The fourth season of HBO's cherished comedy drama Succession brings the Roy family's saga and their employment at Waystar Royco to a close. Succession season four has already been a crazy trip, even when compared to the amazing previous seasons. It explores Gojo's acquisition of Waystar Royco, the effects of Shiv and Tom's friendship, and even the passing of Waystar CEO Logan Roy. The final episode of Succession season four finally placed everything in position for the show's concluding episode, which will certainly include a variety of twists, turns, and revelations. The ending of Succession Season 4, Episode 9, sees Kendall and Roman devise a new plan to stop Gojo's buyout of Waystar Royco. The co-CEOs intend to appeal to Waystar Royco's board of directors, hopefully convincing them to stop the Gojo deal from happening. However, it seems likely that this will fail. Although Kendall and Roman have reason to want to stop the deal, the board of directors most likely knows that letting Gojo buy them out is the best move for the company. So, unless the Roy brothers manage to pull off a miracle, it's probable that their final plan okay, will fail. It, but it's all right. If Kendall and Roman's plan is unsuccessful, Gojo will likely acquire Waystar Royco and appoint Lucas Matson as CEO. The Roy siblings' unsuitability to lead the corporation has been repeatedly demonstrated in Succession Season 4. Therefore, the conclusion wouldn't hold if Kendall and Roman continued to hold that position. Given that Matson's acquisition of Gojo appears to be imminent, Succession will probably finish with him acquiring control of the business, placing him in the same position Logan Roy held before to his passing. ATN prematurely predicts Jared Menken's victory in the presidential election in Succession Season 4, and it will bite Waystar Royco in the season finale. Roman and Tom were informed that ATN might be subject to protracted legal action, as well as a negative shift in the public's opinion, if the election is declared invalid. The presidential election outcomes will likely factor into the series finale, and as the setup hasn't yet paid off, possibly bringing Waystar Royco to his knees at the conclusion of Succession. Early in Succession Season 1, Cousin Greg was the black sheep of the family, with him being the one redeemable character. However, as Greg has climbed the corporate ladder throughout Succession's four seasons, he has become just as bad as the rest of the Roys. Greg has fired huge swaths of employees lied, blackmailed, and more. Due to how bad Greg has gotten, it'd be impossible to give a last-minute redemption to the character. Because of this, it seems that the Succession series finale will conclude Cousin Greg's tragic downfall without redeeming him. Shiv and Tom had a wonderful relationship when Succession first began, but things changed for the worst in Season 3, and things have only gotten worse for the ex-couple in Season 4. While there have been times when they appear to be happy, the good times are vastly surpassed by the bad ones. Their continual fighting has become more heated in the second part of the season. Despite the possibility that Shiv's pregnancy may cause the two to put their differences aside and reconcile, it seems much more likely that Shiv and Tom will not reconcile in Succession series conclusion. Things just keep getting worse for Tom, as it also seems like he will lose his job at ATN in the Succession series finale. In Succession Season 4, Episode 8, Matson and Shiv begin spreading rumors that Tom will depart from ATN soon, to Tom's surprise. Matson is probably doing this in order to set up Tom's firing. Once Gojo buys Waystar Royco, with ATN's new parent company, wanting to take the conservative news network in a different direction. With that comes big leadership changes, meaning that Tom will probably be out at ATN. Viewers have conjectured that Logan Roy got Carrie pregnant before his death throughout Succession Season 4. Although it has been suggested, the Succession Season finale is unlikely to make this explicit. Carrie's pregnancy will likely continue to be a possibility after the finale, as there is simply not enough time left in the show to justify the introduction of this narrative. Succession has been a competition between the Roy siblings, and the season finale will most likely end with Shiv winning, while Kendall and Roman lose. If Matson's plan goes through, which seems likely, he will appoint Shiv as the CEO of Waystar Royco's American branches. On the other hand, Kendall and Roman will be ousted from their co-CEO positions, meaning that Shiv will be on top at the end of the Succession series finale.
Although the Roy siblings have never been very close, by the end of succession, they will be even more divided. Shiv's cooperation with Matson has already made Kendall and Roman resentful of her, so their relationship is doomed to failure. However, the political and corporate views that separate Kendall and Roman are already causing a rift between them. If the ATN presidential election is marred by controversy, the brothers' relationship will only worsen.